Well, here we go, baby. Spirit Guardian Battle 2.0. Or more like round two, I suppose. I don't know if this is going to go any differently to the first attempt, but I I, <laughs> I don't know what to do. Do I stick to the original Miola plan? Do I stick to my usual self and just go 1v1 toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Spirit Guardian? Or do I wind it back and try a little bit of strategic action? I'm just not a very good strategist, nor am I good at executing a plan, which is why I'm very nervous about this and I don't really know what to do. But my my urge to just run in, run and gun, 1v1, straight in like that is really, really overwhelming. But what do we have leading into this? Who can help us? What can we do? Well, first and foremost, we have ourselves our demonic parasaur who isn't leveled up, I just realized, but um, is an option. We also got our celestial allosaurus who may not have what it takes to take the thing down, but it can ground it and it can be a useful ally in the battle if we do want to follow strategic purposes. In my inventory, we have ourselves our demonic reaper empress who is not leveled up, but I do have a max experience potion here ready to go to get it there. Also, it is 100% imprinted for the first time yet. On top of this, um, our Chaos Rex. I don't really have much to say about the Chaos Rex. I don't I don't think it's going to be useful in this instance. Honestly, this guy here is my main attraction. Oh, and on top of all of this, uh, my Argentavis, who I'm assuming is currently upstairs. There you are. Uh, we had a little uh, random straggler roam into the base after yesterday's video. And so everybody's a little bit displaced and all over the place. I'm pretty sure I've collected everybody though. Uh, but yeah, with this new and improved imprinted RG, I did have... My dude, you got... You got stuff on you um, with also 58 levels up your sleeve. I did have the curiosity of maybe just like hello where are you going trying to bring up my mountain or something i did have the curious curious tendency to just fly around the spirit garden to see if we can actually survive um just dropping big old x bombs like that on it i can't see it really working like insanely well but i feel like there might be something to it right <laughs> Either ways, I uh, don't have a good feeling, but we're still going to try some things. We're going to see how it goes. Honestly, I feel like there is some merit in retrying what we attempted last time, except this time with the Reaper Empress. If I can get this thing trapped, there might be something there. I don't know. But guys, before we head out, if you do enjoy the video, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up. Hey, it lets me know that you're still enjoying it as much as I'm enjoying recording it and getting my butt kicked. Anyways, let's go. So, uh, first things foremost, if we are going to bust out this Reaper, uh, let me just... Yeah, I didn't think there'd be enough room here. Um, all right, let me hit up one of our little areas, like our little... Uh, the Dancing Dome, which... Uh, unfortunately, the big light has been deactivated. Now, you're not going to fit in here, are you? I mean, physically, no, but enough that I should be able to access your inventory. Yeah, good enough. Uh, and basically, I'm going to go and drop this inside of you. Max experience potion. That's going to allow me to quickly throw 300 levels wherever I like on this beast. It's starting out with a total of 6 million health. How did our previous one get to like 200 million health? Was it broken? Or have they just been upgraded since? I completely forgot. With that last one, there was some weird jankiness where it gave us the... Oh, I don't even know anymore. Anyways, I guess this one's not going to be as strong as our last one. Man, we really messed up bad with our old Reaper, didn't we? Our old Reaper was such a beast. They were like nothing. It was untouchable. It was... It was li Actually, no. The, the Chaos Guardian nearly did take it down. But, And then we went and did the little improved Reaper update. And it absolutely annihilated the darn thing. We really never should have done that. That was terrible. That was a terrible move on my part. And I regret it to this day. But anyways, we can't turn back time. We can't undo these things. That is 200 levels that we've dropped in. 156 into damage and 45 into health. I don't think this guy's going to have enough health this time around. I'm going to be honest with you. I think this is going to be a really nerfed Reaper compared to our amazingly superior one that we had previously that really i never should have upgraded and never should have got it killed that's 20 million health i might be crazy but i swear our other one had over 100 million if not 200 million anyways that's much health we're going to give this thing let's go and give it some melee damage as well and i guess this thing is completely maxed out um i don't necessarily need to pick it up but I do need to... By the way, this admin mode thing, I don't know what it means at the top of the screen, but I know when you right-click with this gun, it enables it and disables it. 
Um, either way, we've got it soul bold. Let's go. Do we just run with that and see how it goes is the next question. Or do we actually go for some strategy here? I want to bring my Allosaurus out, but I know it's going to get its butt whooped. Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's just go. Let's just do this thing. Let's just see what happens. Assuming I still have everything I need, which we do. Let's craft up the Spirit Guardian Summoner. And let's see if I can repeat the Chaos Guardian fight rather than repeating the Spirit Guardian fight. There is actually one other thing we could attempt to do. And that is chucking this inside of here and then augmenting this with extra armor. I just don't know how high that can go. Increased weapon damage. That's not the one we want. Increased armor. So if I go like, I don't want 120 of these, by the way. But look, let's just, let's just do that, right? If I augment this, how high can we get it? This is another way for us to increase our saddles, by the way, in a very cheap fashion, at least compared to the proper upgrading. It's already maxed out as far as capabilities go. But basically, I want to see if we can surpass the 1200 armor that our other one is. And so far, we're close. 1190, 1222. How high does it go? Because I need every little bit of protection that we could. I think that's it. That's maxed out. 1400. Okay, well, we're going to bring that saddle with us, obviously. I think that part goes without saying. Uh, it's going to be a little bit tedious to switch over, but it is what it is. All right, let's go. Let's do this thing. We've got health potions ready to go. Uh, let me have a, grab a little little bit of a sip of water real quick. Just pop up here into my bedroom. A little water tap. Oh, I have a little drink from the fountain. In fact, what I should do, what I should do real quick is fill up my little water jar. There we go. All right, fantastic, fantastic, fantastic. Um, hey, look, if this goes wrong... <laughs> it is what it is, I suppose. We lose ourselves another Reaper. I fully expect this to go wrong just for the record. In fact, wait, one more thing I can do is get myself a teleporter. That way, I can get back to the desert nice and fast. Because we don't really have any teleporters over that side of the map. So it would be handy to have something in that general vicinity. Because yes, we are going back to the desert, obviously. Did I not mention that? Well, I meant to mention that. Now I just mentioned that. Anyways, let's go to the desert. I completely forgot that these guys exist. So, oh, oh, no. No, that is such a good... Okay, this is why I want to tame one of these guys, just for the record. They can do that. And I don't know how strong that is, but I assume it is quite strong. Not to mention, it cocoons dinosaurs. It freezes them. They can't, they can't move. They can't fly. That's a level 672. I can tame that, I'm pretty sure. Or at least I could have. But I'm pretty sure I just used the soul we need to craft the bone meal. Let me just let me just double check that. So basically, we need to craft one of these to tame it up. Easy enough. Thing is, it needs a Empress Soul and an Emperor Soul. Oh, I'm having second thoughts here, guys. Everything else we can do. I just need that Celestial Emperor Soul. Which means, if I can take down one more Celestial Emperor... Alright, I might try that tomorrow. Either ways, dude... That thing is a beast. To mention, I'd love to take down that Origin Rex right alongside it. That, I think, is the highest level skeletonized T-Rex we've seen thus far. Okay, no, we can't. We can't. We can't deviate from the plan, can we? Oh, but look at that power. It's just next level. I just hope it doesn't. It's, oh, this is that moment. We already missed out on the Celestial Therizinosaur the other day due to basically us not taming it there and then. Now I'm wondering if we're going to repeat history and miss out on the opportunity to tame this as well. You know, like, what if it dies? What if it despawns? It, it, either. Either can happen. Yeah, I just don't know. Uh, alternatively, though, we could just sit here and try our best to fight a spirit guardian on the other side of this gate. Is it worth a shot? I have no idea. But um, I, think, I think that's just what we're going to do. So... Uh, Reaper, come to play. There we go. All right, you are so big. You're such a big target. I really hope, I really hope I don't regret this decision. But then again, these guys are replaceable. It's not the end of the world. If things do go wrong, we're just gonna have to deal with it. If this goes wrong, <laughs> maybe I will go and get the skeletonized T-Rex instead. So let's switch out the saddles to begin with. Um, oh, I gotta place a teleporter somewhere. Well, lucky for us. And move around really quickly. So let's just place it like over here somewhere. Uh, hold on a second. Giant Reaper just appeared in front of me. Goodbye. 
dude this guy has a tank okay hold on it's not dead yet it's not dead yet okay a little bit stronger than i expected let me see how strong my big old x attack is just for the, for the, by the way by the way all right still melts still absolutely melts dinosaurs but can it deal billions of damage is i guess the big question um i'm trying to place my teleporter let's place this down here there we go <laughs> such an awkward spot for a teleporter but right now i just don't care and i guess the moment of truth oh i'm gonna regret this so darn much this goes against everything the mod developer told me to do pick on i apologize in advance for what you're about to witness people at home i apologize in advance for what you're about to witness but yeah no they're, they're, i really got i got I really really got nothing i really got nothing to say this is about to go horribly wrong and i'm gonna regret this for ever so uh i guess we're gonna power up <laughs> i'm not ready for this and then i'm gonna summon it in and then i'm gonna run away i'm gonna back up big time well oh i forgot it was gonna spawn above me but that's okay is it okay hold on 5.1 billion health i'm hoping he just dropped his major bomb attack didn't he my health potions I forgot to prepare them okay hold on it definitely hit me but i seem to be resistant in some manner because it didn't drain me to pieces just then okay all right guys 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 this is working this is working this is definitely working okay i copped some sort of damage from his attack but it didn't it didn't kill me okay good 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 it seems that we can keep just enough distance to like not I just I just don't want it if I get too close to him it's going to provoke him and he's going to drop big bombs on me or he's going to escape do not escape just sit right where you are do not move do not move please don't move just sit right there oh my gosh we've dealt 200 million damage to it already this might actually be working <laughs> just imagine if we'd done this a week ago imagine if I'd never lost my demonic reaper empress to the stupid celestial indominus rex emperor we could have done this from the start we never would have had to second attempt this thing I've got him janked there he is jankily jankified. He is jankily jank jank jankily jank jankified under that bridge. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to sit here and spam X until I can't spam X no more. We're honestly the only downside. Health potions, health potions, health potions right this second. Okay. All right, got, a, got ahead of myself, guys. That was a good, that was a good little reminding factor that, oh, he's escaped. Oh no. Oh no. Where did he go? No, 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 no. Oh, it's going to be so hard to get him back into that spot. But then again, I can fight him. Like, we just. Oh, now he's like well and truly up in the sky. I don't half a billion damage, though. Um. Okay, as long as he doesn't kill my skeletonized T Rex that I plan to tame. Honestly, my Reaper seems pretty good against. Like, not against the attack, but. I can, it's, it, oh gosh. He's following me around. He's right here. He's right here. Go, run, run, run. I don't think I've got any heals active either right this second. I don't even know where he's gone to. Where is he? Where did he go? <laughs> he was coming for me. Uh, he's, he's around here somewhere. He's got to be. There he is. Oh, he got grounded. Oh, something grounded him. Low. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. Get, get get wrecked hold on where are my potions it's so hard to see them they're just like oh gosh he just dropped this big bomb okay ouch ouchies 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 ouch a lot of damage a lot of damage ouchies 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 okay okay <laughs> this is so stupid this is so bad <laughs> i mean we somehow just dealt another 100 million damage to the thing but okay it's it's we're, we're, we're doing it's we're dealing damage we're just he's not grounded also i'm way too close to him I'm going to drop my better health potions for a second. Okay. Okay. I'm sweating. I'm sweating hard. But we can tank that attack because of the because of the Reaper's damage reduction. That's what's doing it. I forgot that the Reaper has damage reduction. Okay. Something has grounded it yet again too. Okay. Spirit Bomb. It was active there. Something is grounding it and it's not me, but I love it. Whatever's doing it, keep doing it, please. Okay. Right. So we've actually dealt with some pretty solid damage here um i just gotta i mean it's grounded so that's nice 
I'm going to actually drop a primal health bomb on it, on me, potion, whatever it is, um, just to keep my healing up and everything activated. But we are creaming this thing. We're melting it like butter, baby. This is... Until that happens, then I absolutely poop bricks for a second. Oh my gosh. I don't know if my computer's going to crash or if I'm going to crash. My brain's going to crash. Something's going to crash. That's all I know when he drops that attack. <laughs> but we're still at it, baby. And for some reason, he's just sticking to the ground, which I love to see. No, no, no. Back to the ground. No, no, no. I was just, I was just saying I like to see you on the ground. So can you return? Return to the ground, please. Whoever keeps grounding him, please do it again because I appreciate... No, not me. <laughs> He's in the water. Yo, he's going to drown. Let's drown his butt. I honestly have no idea who's doing it to him, but I love it. Um, all right, I'm trying to drop my attacks, but they're not working. 1.3 billion down. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Oh my gosh, I can't... I'm, I'm just glad we're not getting insta-KO'd the way we were last time around because that was just atrocious. We're actually hanging in there. Everything's actually working out. Okay, he dropped that bomb, but it went straight over my head. So get wrecked. That's what happens. That's what happens when you get cocky, mate. Trust me. I know all about getting overconfident. I honestly think he's cocooning himself. I reckon he's grounding himself. Except I don't know if my... Oh, yes. That was a good hit. I was going to say, I don't know if my attacks can make it underwater. They seem to be. All right. Ground yourself again, dude, because that was really cool. Please do it again. One and a half billion down. Guys, we are a third of the way through this thing. We might actually... Oh. <laughs> okay, I just turned into a pinball. Um, just, just casually cruising around a pinball machine right now. But it's cool. It's giving me a second to breathe. I can activate some of my weaker health potions just in case I decide we need those. And we can go in for round two, three, four, whatever round we're up to. I don't even know. No! Why am I gliding across the sky? He was like... He was there. He was ready to get hit, ready to get hurt. All right, let's go again. Just chill in the water there, will you? All right, at least we got a bit of a breather session here. I can take a deep... Oh, he's coming for me. I didn't even realize it was right on my toe. Okay, well, his minions are about to fall again. Pretty sure my health potion did absolutely no good for anybody. Didn't even get to fight him during the course of their runtime. Um, he's sneaking behind me, which I'm not a big fan of, but that's cool because we're gonna I need like a direct hit If I can get him to follow me, I might be able to get him back into That little That little tight alleyway, man, maybe I even head towards the obelisk I don't even know if I can fit through this gap to be honest Oh, that was actually kind of risky when I think about it because what if I got stuck in there? He would have just had me trapped all right, let's not forget either that he can go and drop his big bomb and launch me to smithereens too. So, knowing that, I'm going to drop a health potion. That way I can hopefully cover some of the damage when he inevitably does it. In fact, maybe I just... Mm, this is such a bad idea. I should not be right up against him like this. But I just want to get, like, direct hits with my big old blasts. Okay. Okay, we're dealing damage. That's nice. I mean, what about my right click? There we go. All right. All right. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Now we've got mega damage dropping. Dude. No, oh, I've got mega. Okay, he's dropping the mega damage. Never mind. Oh, I actually got a bit bloody there. I saw my screen go a bit red. He's going to fly away again. Of course he is. <sighs> okay, 2 billion. We're 2 billion down. He's got me. He got me in a tight spot there. But we're still at it. We're still going. And this battle has gone on far longer than I expected. We're taking it to a second biome. But he's just a little bit too quick for me. Not to mention, he can fly. Which is... Oh, he's coming back. He's coming back. He's coming back. Yes. Flew straight into my projectiles. That's what you get, dude. That's what you get. Come on. We're going to hit it. We're finishing this today. No more spirit guardian. I'm going to surpass you. And I'm never going to look back. Tomorrow, I'm going to come back in. We're going to we're gonna craft a, a, a spirit orb. We're going to... Tame some spirit dinosaurs. That's it. Just visualize the dream. Visualize it. Put it in your head and it's going to come true. There's a word for that and I can't remember what it is, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> Let's go. Three billion to go. And I just can't, I just can't damage him right this second. This is not working out. 
All right, I just need to bite him. I need to bite him. I think that's what I got to do. Okay. And then I got to get him back into a tight spot. Honestly, I want him back in the... I want him back in the canyon. The canyon fight just... It just seems so good. I love it when he's stuck in there. Then again, hold on. Hold on. Oh, I thought he was stuck in a bit of a tight situation there for a second. I was wrong. I'm, I'm ready to go to the obelisk. The desert obelisk. If I can get him back out there... Just like we did the Chaos Guardian. Ah, uh, we'd be done by now, I reckon. Oh, that's the damage spot. That's the spot. That's it. Come on. I'm also taking so much. <laughs> I hate it when, like, I hate it when you're getting hit more often than you can actually, like, even see yourself. But it actually works out in my favor because he goes and grounds himself. And look at the damage he's taken. He's halfway down. Okay, yes. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, my goodness. He has, like, he's hurt himself here. Oh, that backfired, didn't it, buddy? That backfired big time. Yes, drop another spirit bomb on me. I dare you. I double dare you. Let's go. Drop it right on me. Let's do it. <laughs> drop it like a deuce. Let's do it. Come on. Come on. Spirit bomb. Spirit bomb. I want you to ground yourself again so I can just pulverize you. Go, go, go. I know you want to. I know you want to. Stop summoning these little friends. Let's get your big bomb out. Where is it? Three million. Three billion, rather, left to go. I get the feeling he's going to use his spirit bomb any second. It's going to go Goku on us. Goku against Frieza. There it is. And... Oh, he grounded himself. Yes. Yes, he's grounded. He's grounded. So am I. But I can't fly, so I don't really care. My health is dropping very quickly. But I'm going to ignore it. Because this is damage time. Come on, I'm trying to drop my, like, crazy strong attacks. He's got me down to half health. Just for the record. I don't even know what I'm damaging right now. I don't even think it's him. I thought it was, but it, there's someone else here that's taking damage. No, I'm wasting the opportunity right now. Wait, no, maybe it was him. Was that just a visual bug? I think it was just a visual bug. Either way, he is somehow down to 1.3 billion now. He's flying away. All right, go, 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 go. We're both like super slowed. Yeah, I don't even know what happened to him, but he took some damage or something. I don't know. Out of nowhere, he's just got 700 million health missing. Ah, uh, this is how it's done. The Reaper Empress is just off this. He's out of this world. Off the charts. 1.2 billion. Oh, I hate this so much. It's such, an, it's such an intimidating attack to be like stuck in the middle of. All right, here we go. Here we go. Unfortunately, he didn't get grounded in that. I guess he was like too far away from it. Okay, we've run out of uh, alpha uh, alpha potions. I think we've just got apexes. No, we ran out of apexes. We've only got alphas left. But we still got the fabled and we still got primals. Oh, there it is. There it is. Yes, he's grounded. He's grounded. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, now is our chance. Moment to shine. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, drop the bombs. Drop the bombs. There we go. More bombs. More bombs. There we go. 1.1 billion. There you go. 1 billion. Here we go. Yes, he's down below a billion. We've got the final one. We can see that health falling is down. 900 million, 850, 800 million, 700, 650. We're melting him alive. This is the moment. No, 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 no. Don't launch me away. He's down to half a billion. Half a billion, half a billion. 400, 470. There we go. 450, down to 400 million. I feel like I'm calling a horse race right here. 350, 330, 300. He's below 300 million. Oh, can I get a 200 million? Can I get a 200 million? Maybe 150, 100 million. Let's go. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. <gasps> We're going to do it. Primal Raptor just died to get wrecked. Oh, spirit bomb. Yo, that was going to send me across the map. I reckon that was his last ditch effort to like finish this thing off too. He nearly, I if, if I don't even know what I got launched into, but I nearly just got sent across this map. He's down, he's low, he's low. 50, look at that, 59 million left. 59 million left. If I could just get him with a good, clean shot, we're done. And that might be it. Not quite, not quite. We did get him, but it wasn't like a clean shot. Oh, he's got me with... The oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. We're dying. We're dying. Oh, he got me below half health. He actually got me below half health. But he's grounded himself in the process, leaving himself vulnerable for my finishing attack, and we're done. We are done. <laughs> we are done. <laughs> oh, the week-long journey to take down the Spirit Guardian.
has been completed. And it turns out all we needed was our Demonic Reaper Empress. My goodness, my girl, you have done wonderful today. We went through a lot of resources to make that happen, but look at what we ended up with. Not really much, but now we can graft up the Spirit Orb, which unlocks so many darn possibilities. I don't even know where to begin. All right, let's take you home. Oh my goodness, I'm sweating. You guys have no idea how sweaty I am. <laughs> I feel like I've just run a marathon. It was a bit of a marathon of a fight when you think about it. Um, but yo, we did it. Okay, I didn't really plan to be falling down a mountain right this second. I just wanted to be back in my base. So, let's try that again. Second time around. <laughs> Ooh -wee. All right, I'll worry about, I'll worry about bringing her up here in a second. So, let's have a look at exactly what that means for us. Obviously, like I said, the orb has been unlocked. I, what about, what about? Hmm, we can craft this, right? Yo! Yes, we can! <laughs> um, okay. So, if, let's say, we wanted to fight one of the next tier bosses. Oh, we need the Demonic Reaper Emperor Soul and the Emperor Soul. So, we do need to fight another Emperor either way. But then also, I want to get the Skeletonized T-Rex if he survived that fight, which I don't know if he did. This here, though, is the next tier of bosses that we will be facing. We obviously are not ready to do that. We need a few tributes. We need a few things to make that happen. But we have the orbs to go and tame some spirit dinosaurs tomorrow. But no, tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. We got other things to do. Tomorrow, skeletonized T-Rex time, baby. Yeah, I didn't even know. I honestly thought skeletonized T-Rex would be like the fallback to then fight the spirit guardian a third time. Either ways, we definitely need one. Guys, thank you for watching. I'm going to go and rest. This week-long journey to take down this pest has been completed.